hello and welcome back beautiful collective thanks everybody for your views your likes your comments and i do appreciate all of your subscriptions thanks so much and welcome to you new subscribers i'm just pulling on the two tarot decks here i want to find out what the current energy of your counterpart is what is the current energy of the collective's counterpart what is their current energy tucker no no get down that's my dog he's trying to steal my granddaughter's toys whoa queen of wands first card out passionate about the queen of wands wanting to romance the queen of wands hmm Mm. Hmm. They want to message you. I think that, yeah, so see, they were being sneaky and deceptive. Hmm. Hmm. Something about trying to get out of something. What's going on? Hmm. Hmm. So here's this other lover that they were playing around with. Are they saying that they're moving or traveling, making a decision to walk away? Well, we know that's why they walked away from you, but what the hell is this? What the hell is this? They're against uh, I don't know They're trying to Push away this connection. Mm, they're feeling manipulated. They want it. They're holding on to the past person. They're holding on to your messages. They are reading your messages. They're looking at your pictures. And it's like they're pushing away this other connection. Well, because they're stressing out. They're up late at night. They're stressing out. And they're like waiting or turning their back. Waiting, trying to get their strength and courage up to... Damn, see? Well, something to do with their a message. Something to do with a blocked message. Hmm. Or a child. You're looking at this. Taking leadership here. They're emotionally going through a roller coaster. They're in love with. They're in love with the Queen of Wands. They're working on ending something because 
they've they're going through a separation and it's like wherever they went to they've been hurt the karma is kicking their ass for the choice they made they're angry at the karma they're receiving they want to apologize to their soulmate who they ghosted they want a new beginning hmm. oh they want to tell you now i'm telling you right now that there is a karmic child involved in some of these situations There is a karmic child involved. The karmic could have a child or there is an actual karmic child involved. They are angry at the karma that they are receiving since they met up with this karmic. They are stressing out about a karmic child. It's what changed everything. Now, either the karmic has said that they were pregnant or they actually had a child with the karmic. There is a char karmic child involved somehow. And they want to tell you the truth, that they love you. They want to reconcile. They want to. To work on this partnership they have high honor and respect for you but they were foolish that's why this person feels stuck okay because they did something foolish they took a risk and a lot of these had a karmic child or there's a karmic child involved somehow that's why, but they're in love with you. They're getting their karma. And they're angry at the karma that they are receiving. The emperor heavily burdened by this ending i'm telling you with this they're in love with the temperance angel okay mm. Mm. I should tell you right there. I don't know if this person married the pregnant karmic. I don't know if they're planning to get married to the empress or because this karmic said they were pregnant. You'll know in your story. Hmm. Well, they're doing an awful lot of thinking about making something fair. They're watching you. They're spying on you. They're thinking. Hmm. So, damn.
they are going through a financial uh, problem here. They are regretful, they are crying, they are sad with the option that they chose putting you in a competition, they regret it. They're fighting and arguing. There's too many people involved. It's like everybody getting in their business here. The karmic, the karmic's family. I don't know. They're like regretting their decision. They could be sick. But I think it's more financially. They're going through something financial with the karmic. To just sit near power struggling. They regret their choice, I can assure you of that. They are spying on you and they're thinking about marriage. They're thinking about healing this connection. They know they broke your heart. They can't stop thinking about you. They're watching you. They're thinking about commitment and marriage now. I don't know if they got into a marriage with this karmic and married them because they were pregnant. I don't know. I just know that they're watching you. I know that how they're thinking, how am I going to heal this with the Empress energy? You could be this Emperor. Maybe the person you're dealing with is thinking of how they can heal things with you. There is a karmic child involved. It's here, I have to say it. Whether they be a, a baby or whether they be a uh, adult child, I don't know. All I do know is they are regretting their choice and decision. They could have lost a bunch of money or they could have fallen ill. They're not doing well wherever they're at. Especially if they're always thinking about you. Especially if they're in love with you and seeing your wealth here and seeing your independence. That's who they're thinking of, the past. They're looking at your messages. They're looking at your photographs. They know they hurt you. I don't know if they married this person or they got into commitment with this person. Whatever they did, they're regretting. I don't want that tarot deck. Let's find out, spirit. They're angry at this karmic energy. Why are they angry? Gold digger. This karmic is blocking them from you.
Karmic's just like money hungry. They're like, give me the money, give me the money. As above, so below, they're learning a lesson. Jeez. They're holding on to you. Someone was pulling the wool over their eyes. They were hiding something. Hmm. Illusion. It was an illusion. So the karmic pulled over an illusion on this person. They're a pretender. They pretended to have wealth. They got nothing. Yeah. Karmic's making them financially unstable. They're like an illusionist. They are like selfish. Unfair, unjust. Mm. They might have done something risky, like purchased a home. Thinking that this karmic was financially secure. Or that they would be, it's like, they thought they would be victorious. I don't know. Watching you. Something about they want to work on things with you. I mean, it's that simple. They're in love with the past person. It's like they wanted to tell you the truth, but what's going on? They're trying to push back their emotions, fighting their emotions. It's like their cards are coming out all weird, man. Not waiting. That's jealousy. Locked messages, holding on to your messages. 
They were manipulating the karmic is manipulating. The, whoa, they're a fake empress or lying about a pregnancy. They thought that this third party was an empress, but they're a fake empress. They're a fake. They wasted their time. They know you're their soulmate. They know who their soulmate is. They're a fake, a phony. This other lover is a fake, a phony. They could have faked a pregnancy or faked something. They're like selfish, man. They're not investing. They don't invest. They're not loving. They're not nurturing. It's not working out, this other love connection. They're angry at this other lover. They're weak, man. They're a weakling. This person is angry because they're getting their karma. Their fortunes have changed. Their finances have changed. They're fighting, arguing. Damn. Hmm. Something to do with, uh, so they thought that this, they're hurting financially, the karmic. That's why they're walking away. Broke. Hmm, doing something secretive. Hmm. Yeah, something has come out about a child. A conception of a child. The burden by the karmic. Karmic is a sneak. And this person wants to go to the temperance angel that they hurt, but they're in the boat alone. They know the truth. On a passionate new beginning, they're stuck on their star. So this person really went through a crossroads. That's why they're going through Dark Night of the Soul, because whoever they went to, they were just using them for their money. That's what they're doing, the gold digger, in a huge way. There's no love, there's no affection there, there's nothing. This person still views you as their soulmate. They're watching you, especially if you're on a platform or you're a tarot card reader, they are watching you. They're watching you be wealthy, they're watching your glow up. This person is holding on to your messages, your pictures, or something like that. And they're looking at a new beginning or a new opportunity. So this karmic is in it for the money. So was this person at one point. There's no doubt about it.
yeah, they're going through it. Mm. Yep. No stability there. Karmic is pushing them into spend money, spend money, spend money. Buy me a house. Buy me this. Buy me that. Buy me the other thing. It's all money, 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 money. Could have uh, got this person into some real estate, real estate scam. Yep. They invested in some kind of home or property or real estate scam. The karmic's just like, come on, pay, pay, pay. Buy me this, buy me this, let's do this, let's do that. Buy, buy, buy. Gimme, gimme, gimme. They're fighting and arguing about money all the time. They're fighting and arguing about this child. So this karmic used a child as a weapon. why they're going through dark night of the soul this karmic is nuts man delusional ideas of grandeur you know wanting it all wanting everything buy 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 give it to me this just spending this person's money hand over fist and they pretended to be financially secure and they're the five pentacles this person's left holding the bag of everything. They will be leaving that situation and they are leaving alone. Take care.